This home plate commemorates your name as one of two catchers in Major League Baseball history to catch four no-hitters. You're invited to join Philadelphia music legend John Oates as he sings our national anthem. In the home of the brave. Back here at Citizens Bank Park, we've already had a great start to Toyota Alumni Weekend, Major League Baseball's uh, Players Weekend. You see the number 27 on the side of the hat, sort of a throwback to uh, when these guys were kids. Those numbers on the side of the hats, which they'll wear all weekend long. Major League Baseball said they're an expression of youthfulness of athletics in general. Fans who like them can buy them from the uh, New Era team store. Some of them are pretty sharp. All right, there's Aaron Nola warming up as he gets ready to make his start here at Citizens Bank Park. Nola's numbers, 25th start, 11 and 6, and a 3.60 ERA. Fly ball, right center field, pretty well hit. Playable, though, for Castellanos. And he'll make the catch away. Abrams hitting at 251, and it grazed him. He's hit by the pitch. That's three games in a row. He's been hit by a pitch. He's been hit 15 times now for the year. Ground ball through the right side. James Wood checks in with a hit. CJ going first to third and the Nationals early scoring opportunity against Aaron Nola. Here's Andres Chaparro. Reach base in all three games in a Nationals uni. Topper back toward the middle. Turner's got it on the second base bag over to first. Inning is over. Much needed 6-3 double play. No runs. One hit. One man left. And here's Patrick Corbin. Another crack at win number 100 in the 35 year old's career. Kyle Schwarber leads things off, and in this player's weekend, he's got an awesome Louisville slugger that has a Schwarbob cartoon on it. Nice play over there by Juan Yepes towards the line. He's going to take it himself, and a missile off of Kyle Schwarber's bat results in a sparkling defensive play by Yepes. Like Trey Turner's using a Marucci. And he's got a couple of different ones that he's using tonight. One of them for the Jimmy V Foundation. I think that's the Jimmy V Foundation one that he has. Line drive, base hit to right center field. And Turner's aboard. And a one out single. Bryce Harper, 26 home runs, 73 runs batted in. He's using a Victus bat that has all different, uh, different drawings on it. Turner on the move as Harper pops it up left side. C.J. Abrams back. James Wood comes in and he has it for out number two. He's got a city connect bat. This matches everything. Out to shallow right center field. Young's on the way in. It drops in for a hit. Turner goes to third. 33 game on base street for Alec Ball. Nick is swinging his sweet Chandler bat. That uh, looked like fish gills, don't it? I believe that's what it is. Mermaid maybe? Yeah. Swinging a high pop fly. Shallow right call coming in has a play. Should end the inning. He makes a one handed catch, and that will do it for the Phillies in the first. Most innings pitched since 2016. These two guys lead the way across Major League Baseball. Garcia line drive to left center. That'll fall in front of Wilson. And Louie doing it again to the opposite field. He was 0 for 4 last night, slowly to the left side, cut off by Baum. Little hesitation. They get the lead runner at second. So 5 4 on the put out. Runner goes, pitch outside, throw to second base. Oh, is right. in time. Wow, what a throw. What a throw. Yepes says, take a look at it. Nope, they're not challenging. They are not challenging. The inning is over. JT catches his 11th of the year. JT Realmuto, the Phillies catcher, hitting at 252, and a breaking ball is in there. Slider called strike three, caught him looking with one at the knees. Strike three, and there goes the bat. Oh, Play by Miguel Cairo. Sorry, people. I got to give a standing ovation for the one-hander. Like no big deal. Like uh, continues on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do everything. Hank White letting them know it's all right. And it'll be an easy steal for Rojas. He's 20th. So the second steal of the inning for the Phils. We try to get on the board first here. Swinging a ground ball. Oh, flagged by Corbin of the webbing of his glove, reaching up to his right. He turns and throws the first to Yepes to retire the side. Oh, and two the count. Nolda long hold now to pitch. And it's a called third strike over the outside corner. You got him looking. First strikeout of the game for Aaron. Going out to right field. Castellanos waits for it. 
side is retired. No runs a hit. One man left. Three shutout innings for Aaron Nola. It'd be nice to get on the board early. Trey using his uh, backyard baseball bat. Back toward the middle, off the mound. Base hit it to center field. Two for two tonight. Three for five last night. Ball four. That just missed a cutter. And the Phillies will have two on with nobody out. Pulls this one to third. Tain in a second for one. On the first, they go around the horn for a huge double play. So two down. Here's Nick Castellanos. Still no score. The set and the pitch. Ground ball through the hole on the left side. Base hit. RBI single. The Phillies take the lead. It's 1 0. He's now hitting 30 of his last 41 games. Five game hitting streak. He might be the best shimmier. There's a strike. The throw to second. Castellanos has a stolen base with the element of surprise. And another man in scoring position. JT will try to add to the lead. Ramon's flipped out to right center field. A base hit for Real Muto. Rounding third. Castellanos. RBI single. Five games in a row for JT. Two nothing Bills. And if JT gets hot, oh boy. James now two for five in the series. Shoots one the other way. Alec Bohm will have to give with it. Throws from his back leg, and James Wood is way too quick. Two for two tonight. A single to right, and an infield single to third. Well, it's two balls and two strikes to Luis Garcia. Runners at first and second. And there's a strike three call. Two seamer came back. Yeah, there's nothing you can do about that. Yeah, you just got to take that straw back. Swinging a ground ball towards the middle. Stop dives. Got it. Flips to Turner, wow. and they get the out at second. What a play, Bryson Stott. Terrific play. Three balls and two strikes. Nola is ready and back into the windup. Here's the pitch, and that one's in for a called third strike. Ten pitch at bat. Yeah, he went to every pitch he could think of and finally gets Tanya with that, that breaking ball. Out to center. He's going back on it as Rojas. He's there, makes the catch. Inning's over. No runs, one hit. Ray Turner, who's already two for two, leads it off for the Phils. There's a line drive, base hit it to left center field. Fantastic. Turner's around first. He's going to try for two. The throw, it's offline. He's got it. Sweet slide. Double number 18. Amazing what a day off can do, huh? Swinging a high fly ball, left field. Playable for Wood to his right toward the line. Now coming in, and James Wood makes the catch. Two away, Baum retired, and Nicholas Castellanos will come up now. Swinging a line track to right field. Call coming in, makes the catch. Goes into a slide and holds on to it for out number three. Well, it's two and two for Chaparro. The runner at first, two nothing. Phillies on top. Runner goes, pitches high, throw to second. On one hop, he is out at second base. Well, there you go, having the wow. weapon behind the plate. That wasn't even close. That wasn't even close. And Aaron went with the slide step too, which got the ball quicker to JT, and he doesn't need a lot. Curve ball bounced to third. Low hop, skimmer across the grass as Bohm makes the adjustment and fires to first in time. Swung on and sky to right. It's pretty shallow. Castellanos is in and under it. And he's got it. And the side is retired. The leadoff block, but it caught stealing. Nobody left. And Aaron Noah's still out there. First time he's attempting to get an out in the seventh inning since June 29th. Well, it's hit sharply out to center, but Rojas has been playing deep tonight. He's able to get that one. One away. Juan Yepez, 0 for 2. Couple of ground outs. That's popped up. We got a Harper there. And Bryce does call everybody off. Makes the catch for the second out. So two away. Up tops is going to give him uh, a chance to get this last out. That's high. Ball four. That may be it for Aaron. Let's see what Rob does here. Still sitting in that corner. All right. So Jacob Young is going to be the batter. Line drive out to right center field. That'll be in for a base hit. It's going to the wall. Nope. Cut off by Rojas. Rounding third. Held there is Tana. It'll be second and third with two men down. Rob has already disappeared from his spot, so he's going to come out. Six and two thirds for Aaron Nola. With the top of the order due up, the Phillies will go to the bullpen. It's a season high 111 pitches for Aaron. And Matt Straub will come on for the Phils with runners at second and third, a 2 0 lead. You, know, you could talk about how great Aaron pitched, and he did, but they're one hit away right here from tying this thing up. Hopped up, out to shallow right. Castellanos will take care of call for the fourth time tonight. And the inning is over. No runs, one hit, two men left in scoring position. Billy's on top, two nothing. James on base all three times tonight. Got that OPS up to 808. Lace down the left field line. Another hit for James Wood, and another one to the opposite field. On base all four times tonight, and the tying run will come into the batter's box in the form of Andres Chaparro. Fly ball short right. Stott on the grass makes the catch. 
Mets. Well, here is Ruiz, who hit two solo homers last night, one for three tonight. And a cold strike three on the outside corner. He got him looking. Jeff Hoffman, he saw how Ruiz was frustrated on a few of his pitches. Now, Ruiz nodded yes about that pitch. And then he and uh, Jeff Hoffman kind of stared at each other a little bit. Yeah, a little shimmy by uh, Hoffman, too. <laughs> huh? Carlos Estevez, Estevez will take over on the mound. This is a safe situation for Carlos. And Louie going to set one on the ground through the left side. Yet again, the tying run will step into the batter's box for the Nats. And here's Juan Yepes. He'll send one out to shallow left center. Coming in is Brandon Marsh. He can't get there. Luis Garcia Jr. had to play that one carefully. Make sure Marsh didn't get there on a headlong dive. And the Nats have put two on here in the ninth. Well, here is Tana in a big spot for the Nationals. Sent back up the middle. That's a base hit. Garcia will score. Nunez from first to third. And the Nats making noise here in the ninth. They're back within a run. Do it, Jose Tana. So now the tying run just 90 feet away. Davey Martinez has some options here. You have Young, the very good bunter. Chopper right side. Nunez held up. Now they throw to second for one. They're coming home. And the tying run scores. That was terrible base running at first, it seemed anyway. But the run does score, and we're tied up at two. Swing and a miss. He got him. The inning is over. It's a 2-2 game. We're going to the bottom of the ninth inning. The Phils and the Nationals. All right, Brandon Marshall lead it off. These fans love him. They love him a lot more if he gets on base. Line drive out to right field. Paul's going back. It's over his head. It's a one hop off the wall. Marsh on his way. Oh, no, he puts the brakes on. Paul overthrows everybody. And no one at second. And nobody's at second base, so Marsh then advances. It's a single and a long E9. No balls, one strike. He squares again and bunts it to Perfect. a third. Nobody's there. Everybody is safe. Yeah, they're going to walk him now. So that'll load it up for Trey Turner, who's already strolling to the plate. Looking for his fourth hit of the night. Trying to get the run home somehow, some way. Swing and a fly ball. Out toward left field. Wood will watch it go over his head, and it's off the wall. Marshall score. Trey Turner gives the Bills the walk-off victory. Four-hit night, just like playing in your backyard. Three to two, the Phillies win it.